All right, hey there, everybody. I am back. Uh, feeling a little bit uh, motivated, so decided to jump back into this uh, kind of impromptu. That's okay. Um, so I said a couple things uh, I want to work on. I'm going to get to the monorail station here in a little bit, but first off, I just did some quick measurements on this. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, on this. Uh, the firehouse, the um, town hall, and all that. And I want to get that all uh, squared away and set up before I uh, do anything else. Going to make the outlines for these three, uh, these buildings and the couple of patios here. So I actually need to move this uh, this lamp. Because um, I'm getting rid of all this, um, at least this far over. Uh, basically, the firehouse sits on the um, directly on the road, on Main Street, not on the sidewalk like the rest of the buildings. So, um, oh. So I need to clean this up a little bit uh, while I'm thinking about it. Uh, but let me get the other stuff. I know there's, um, it's like the, so like the, I need steps. To, I got rid of those steps, didn't I? Yep. I'll put that aside for now. I uh, want the the birch steps. There we go. And then this is somewhere around here, but it's gonna be one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then here are the stairs uh, leading into the. Um, Leading into the town hall, which is guest relations. So that's that. And then there's a patio here, but the firehouse is right here. Oh, let me stem. They need, need to line up where the patio is as well. One, two. So that'll be somewhere like right there. And there's no way the firehouse, I have the firehouse list is 10 meters wide. There's no way that's right. <coughs> Let me go back and remeasure that. All right, pulling up uh, the Google Earth really quickly. Seems like the fire station should be about six meters wide, not ten. Yeah, so seven, patio is about 10, 15, 15, eight, and eight. So seven, 10, 15, eight, and eight, okay. All right, so I don't know what I was looking at earlier when I did those uh, measurements. <coughs> yeah. Correct them. 
one. Eight. Seven. Ten. Fifteen. Eight and eight. So, so I might even need to move all this over a little bit. Um, one, two, yeah. All right, and then I need this. I need my. Come on. My iPad, Google Earth. So that's like ten. Actually, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. So one, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one, let's go one. So I think this will be getting adjusted a little bit, but let me kind of line up my buildings first. Yeah, I think all this needs to be up one. So there's seven. <coughs> uh, and then I have a depth of our house, 12, 12 meters deep. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten, eleven, twelve. All right. Because it is a firehouse after all, so the fire truck has to drive out of here, hypothetically speaking, so. But I will put the, the liner up. Oh, that's what I want. So I don't know how long this is going to be. I do have to work tonight, uh, today. Well, yeah, tonight. Uh, in a few hours here, I have to leave. So this won't be super long. So I need to grab a shower and just kind of want to chill for a little while before that go before that happens. But um, like I said, I, was, I just had a little bit of a motivation and inspiration. So I figured I'd jump on and knock out these couple things. And 
And then this is what? 10, 3, 4, 5. So, <laughs> this might not be wide enough at all. Well, let's just uh, go from here. Let's just do the numbers and then let's uh, see where I am. One, two. Fifteen. Uh, next patio is eight. Hmm. Okay, well, it's not bad. And I think we're just going to fudge the patios a little bit. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. What if we made them eight? And this is what, 15? I kind of like, like this being 15. One. It's so hard to see individual blocks at night. I'm trying to count. Sixteen, so yeah, so those are the two I added onto the other end. And I'm gonna make a fourteen, and then I make this one eight instead of whatever I said it is. Eight, and then that's not what I want. Um, I don't think I need the cobblestone stuff anymore, actually. Uh, I need the... The dark plant. Uh, the spruce plant's dark oak. So this will be one, two, five, about six. The stairway is the stairwell needs to move over a little bit um, anyway. This is seven, right? One, two, three, four, five, yes, seven. So I think this little, there's a little patio type area. I uh, need to make sure I do this symmetrically. It's like this isn't going to be here. So, so we go two, all but two on each side. And then and it'll be like the uh, wraparound steps on each side. Is that right? Is that the way I want that? Yes.
And so this is essentially the porch area. Yeah, the the porch area. Yeah, and then the patio starts here. Yeah. Yes, that's right. So I need to angle this off then. Just a bit. And then the, the new the lamp can go here. Nope, that's not what I wanted. There we go. So it's four. Um, I really like doing these beacons better than the glowstone. They're actually kind of uh, attractive almost. <laughs> so, but I have my outline, so that's all I really wanted to, to get done for right now over here. Because um, I just did it in my head quick. I think what'll end up happening is I'll shorten this a uh, little. I'm gonna do this. And then uh, at some point I'll need to. Where's the dirt? Dirt. Actually. At least the back row of this is probably going to be. these uh, beacons brighter I wonder no oh, that's not what I wanted to do speed haste jump boost okay all right never mind I thought maybe I, I don't. I didn't really know that much about beacons. I thought maybe I could make them brighter. <laughs> By giving them some sort of power source, but um, I guess not. All right, so that's lined up. Uh, I'll have to post some pictures at some point to get some real uh, a real look at this stuff. But that's good. Now I want to come back over here. Uh, I kind of realized I fouled this up a little bit. The um, this awning just basically needs to be straight across. Which hypothetically should make it easier to uh, build. <laughs> um, even on the, even on this uh the curve I have going here. So first off, so we have that, then we're gonna have this. Uh, 
Is this longer? Or is it? No, no, no. No, it's fine. And. And so it'll look something like that. Uh, it's not super pretty, but I think that's going to be the best best option. It's not, so it looks like I only have the one turn that I'm dealing with then. I'll have to go up on some on these, obviously, but. So then, would I be better served with it just going st straight? Instead of trying to shoehorn this little ugly bit in for three freaking blocks? Yeah, I think that'll be fine. Make sure everything lined up right still. too far. do believe so. Yep. Well, I need a Rest box over here, don't I?
Ah. Okay. Okay. Sorry folks, I'm concentrating. <laughs> and then go down. Putting some lamps. Ah. have a pattern started so why not It would just be easier to do this, but that's not how it looks in the real world, so... I'll shorten this one just to... Alright, I'll need to take a look at a picture to figure this out, but, um, so that's a half hour. That's kind of what I was shooting for, to be honest. Got, an, got this awning done, and I'm fine with it being just, uh, this far, to be honest. If I really want to, I can extend it a little bit farther if it really gives me, uh, really gives me heartburn, but I need to 
figure out all this because right here, basically the, the top, the roof of the main monorail station is uh, slanted with a bit of a, like a green and white design. And that slanted roof concept goes to the, uh, the top level of the ramp areas as well. So I got to uh, think about and figure out what I'm going to do with that. But, um, but I think that's going to do it for me for now. Again, I have a long day coming up here, long night coming up here. So uh, I'm going to, uh, head on out for now, but, um, I will see you all later. Take care.